Hey guys, welcome to Windy Studio. And today I'm gonna show you how to create a simple poster design just using brush and shape layers on Photoshop. So without any further ado, let's jump into the tutorial. Here we are in Photoshop and first thing first let's drag and drop this image over here and let's turn off the visibility for now and let's fill the background color with some dark color something like this alright and now let's create a ellipse tool and let's change the color to something like this color let's draw a shape so holding on shift and let's make it a little bigger so control t let's put it somewhere over here all right and now let's create a layer max and go to brush and i'm going to use uh, this particle brush too and if you want to download the same brush back check on the description on this below and go to brush and make sure the color is black and let's add some textures Maybe something like Maybe something like this all right now let's turn on the visibility for layer one and let's make it bigger so go to edit, free fast one, let's make it a little bigger. Something like this size. Alright. Now select on layer one and click on the max. And using the same brush, let's get rid of these hard edges over here. I think it's look good to me now let's draw some shapes so for that click over here and go to custom shapes and for now I'll just go for this shape over here Change the color overlay and let's make it like this. Alright. Now let's add some random shapes. So we'll go to ellipse. Change the color over here. Same color like this, and let's bring it all the way to the bottom. Now, let's add some other shapes. So, go over here. So, go for this shape. the opacity to maybe something like this um, I think like it looks good to me so 
let's do some color adjustment so for that click on layer one go to filter go to camera rock filter and let's increase the clarity increase the shadows let's decrease the highlights maybe the clarity is too much so i'll just drop down a little bit and go on sharpening click on image reduction let's add a color lookup table so for that go over here click on color lookup table and from here click on load and i'm going to use this lot and if you want to download the lot pack check on the description list below so select on this one and click on load so now see how easily we can achieve these effects let's decrease the opacity a little down maybe somewhere over here maybe something like this and in between these two layers let's create one more layer and go to brush and using the same brush I'll just go for white color and then if I change the opacity maybe something like this Let's create one more layer. Let's change the opacity to something like this. Alright, now let's add some text. draw one more shape so maybe something like this and create a stroke and change the field to zero and let's So that's the final and hope you guys learned something new from this video and see you guys in the next video.